Have you ever wanted an exotic sports car but just never had the money to buy one? Well today, you're going to find out how to buy an exotic car for up to 7 times less than the starting price. Whoa! Welcome to Supercar Kid. Today, we will be talking about 5 expensive cars that have totally lost their value. So without further ado, let's get straight into it. The first car on this list is a sports car drove by a billionaire in a movie that almost everyone has watched. This is the Audi R8. You will probably recognize this car from the movie Iron Man that billionaire Tony Stark drove. But now a few years have passed and it has fallen on the good side of depreciation. So the good news is you don't have to be a billionaire to own one. When this car first came out, it cost more than $170,000, but now you can get one as low as 40 k I know that's a little bit pricey, but if you think about it, that's the price of a new Ford or Honda SUV that will just depreciate. So now you know the price and you will look rich driving one, but is it fast? The answer to that is yes, very fast. It can do 0 to 60 in under 5 seconds and can go almost 200 miles per hour which is unbelievable stats for a car that's 40k. But if you are an absolute speed demon and 185 miles per hour just isn't enough for you, with a few tunes and a few little upgrades, the possibilities are endless. The R8 is extremely fun and a master at drifting and burning those tires. But is it practical? For all those tall people out there, you're in luck because you can actually fit in the R8. It is surprisingly comfortable and roomy, and the interior looks very sporty. The next car on this list is actually not a car. Yes, you heard me right. This thing is not a car. It's technically a motorcycle, but to me and probably everyone else, it looks like a three-wheeled car. The Polaris slingshot looks like nothing else, I mean, except a Batmobile, and draws a ton of attention. So be it expecting some oohs and ahs, and a lot of people asking what it is and taking a lot of pictures. When I first saw it, I was blown away, and just by the looks, I thought it had to be at least over 100k. But actually it's not, you can get one today for as low as $15,000, and a brand new one for about 20k. Nowadays, that's the price of a junky Toyota. I know this car didn't really depreciate a lot, but it's so cheap that I had to add it. It has basically no windshield, and depending on which version you get, it has no roof either. So you're probably wondering, what happens if it rains? Well, good news is it's water resistant, but I wouldn't want to get my butt sopping wet every time I drive it. So if I were you, I would probably put a cover on it or park it in a garage. It can do 0 to 60 in 5 seconds and has a top speed of 130 miles per hour. While it might not be amazingly fast, everything feels so much faster in real life. And that's great speed for a car that's 15k. The next car on this list might be a little bit pricey, but you will see why in 3, 2, 1. The BMW i8 looks like it's from the future, and yes, it has the famous Lambo doors. But there's more. The interior is beautiful and has very futuristic LED strips running throughout the car. This car used to cost $150,000 when it first came out, but now you can get one for as low as $50,000. It might be a little pricey, but it will save you money in the long run because you don't need to get gas. It has an electric motor which has a range of 330 miles, which is the average range of a Honda Civic or a normal gas-powered car. It can do 0 to 60 in only 4 seconds and has a top speed of 150 miles per hour. It has many modes, ones for comfort and ones for sport. Sport mode is all gasoline powered, but with the added excitement of the electric zero throttle delay. The paddle shifters come in use too. It will draw tons of attention with its looks, and I guarantee it you will look cool pulling up anywhere with those Lambo doors. The fourth car on this list is a car that everyone knows is expensive, but it's actually really cheap. This is the Nissan GTR. It is the go-to modern day tuner car, and with a few upgrades, it can look like Godzilla and be one of the fastest cars in the world. When the Nissan GTR first came out, it cost around $150,000. Nowadays, a used one will only cost you 30 k Yes, you heard me right, $30,000. 
but it doesn't just look cool. Stock, this car has almost 500 horsepower, which can make it go 0 to 60 in 3.4 seconds and has a top speed of almost 200 miles per hour. That is literally the fastest stock car for 30k in the world. But if that's not fast enough for you, people have tuned and upgraded this car to have over a thousand horsepower and beat million dollar hypercars. Oh, and did I mention this is one of the best handling cars in the world. It is made by the same brand that makes some of the cheapest cars on the market today. But don't let the badge deceive you. This is something totally different and is engineered to perfection. You probably assume this is a two-seater sports car, but actually you have room for two kiddos in the back. It's not exactly a family car, but if you wanted it to be, it actually could be. The final car on this list is kind of expensive, but it is one-seventh the price than when it first came out. This is the Rolls-Royce Phantom. This car is no joke. When it first came out, it cost around $500,000. Now you can get one for 70k to 170k, depending on which trim and year you get. There are so many amazing quirks and details that it would take me hours to explain each one, so I've saved the best for right now. First is the roof. It looks like a starry night and has 1,600 fiber optic lights. The lights are dimmable and are useful for lighting up the car's interior at night. All 450 pieces of leather are stitched together by real people. Rolls-Royce only uses the finest materials for the interior, including the finest leather, wood, and glass. There is even 24 karat gold, silver, and crystal throughout the car. This car drives amazingly smooth and is super quiet. The 15-speaker stereo is obviously the best stereo you'll probably ever hear, and the seats make you want to go to sleep. If you find a good one, it might have a 24 karat gold hood ornament, which came as an option when it was bought new. It is very fast for its weight and size. It can do 0 to 60 in 5.6 seconds, and tops out at 155 miles per hour. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video. I've just started YouTube so it would mean a ton if you would subscribe and like this video. Thank you very much and I'll see you next time.